Howdy, howdy folks. Uh, today I'm going to go off and set a few slips. Uh, it is rabbit season here in Newfoundland, Labrador, and I'm going to uh, see if I can hook up a rabbit or two. Just uh, just for one night. I'm only here for the weekend, so uh, I'm going to walk up the trail. See if there's any sign. I know that I noticed some sign earlier this summer, so uh, should be all right. Go up, set a few slips, just give you and give you an idea of how I set my slips. Uh, no different than what everybody else on YouTube has been doing. I have standard fare, I figure. So I won't give you those. I won't show you those details too much, but just give you a layout of uh, the number of slips I set, and uh, we'll see how it goes. Never know our luck. Anyway, stay tuned, and I'll take you along. Looks like a good run. Well traveled. Let's put a slip there. Gosh, guys, as you know, we gotta have these. Uh, in Newfoundland, we have to use brass wire. You're not allowed to use stainless or, uh, sorry, you can use brass or pitcher cord wire. You're not allowed to use stainless. So let's just see this one and straight it out. So as I make my slips and you, you, I'm sure everybody's anybody's watching they've seen all other YouTube videos there's a bunch of YouTube videos about how to set a rabbit slip so I'm not going to go into those details I've watched them myself basically I make the loop same size as my hand and about the same distance from the ground so we'll put that in here I'll give you a shot of it afterwards see what the, see what it looks like when it's in place so I wrap the rabbit snare, the uh, tie it onto the stick, and I wrap around three times before I tie it off onto the stick. I'm using a tree here that's uh, already in place. Looks like there's been a rabbit snare here before. So uh, looks like a good run. Set it up. Put a chin up stick underneath the snares. The rabbit lifts his head up when he goes through the snare. And we'll block off on the side. So I get a few battles here now. Block it off. Comes through there tonight. You never know our luck. We might get lucky. Hang them up. So I'll just take you to see what we have here. So let's see. Had the snare set up. Chin up sticks in place. And the snare is about the size of my hand. About the size left off the ground a bit again. The width of my four fingers. So, which is luck. See how it goes. We're going that way. Now, let's see what else we can find. Straighten out my snare. These are a bit long. That's fine. It gives me some lots of room to play with. Oops. 
guys. I guess you can see that one there. Again, little chin up stick dude, whatever comes through there. Hopefully we'll get them. Stay tuned for tomorrow. Oh, what a beautiful day in the woods, guys. What a beautiful, beautiful day. So I've set out a few snares. Uh, five snares, actually, just enough for... Uh, see if we hook up a rabbit. Snowshoe hare, or whatever you want to call it. We call them rabbits. Proper name is Snowshoe Hares in Newfoundland. So yeah, I set out five snares just up the trail. And I gotta say, this is what I've been looking forward to for a long time out here at the cabin get to enjoy, get into woods and enjoying that in the fall of the year winter comes to be another round of uh, activities when we're looking at uh, go do for some outdoor fires uh, day trips some snowmobile trips outdoor campfires of course and uh, should be great so uh, i head back to the cabin now take my time beautiful day um, and uh, we'll check them in the morning. So I'll take you along with me again tomorrow morning when we come uh, check the uh, check the snares. Look for a grouse too along the way. Didn't see any. Uh, there's been a few around here. I've seen uh, seen them uh, seen them earlier in the summer. Uh, I know there was a brood of chicks here, so that's all right. They, they grow up by now. And uh, maybe you might get lucky tomorrow morning early. You might see one. So uh, let you know how that goes. Alright guys, take care. We'll uh, check it out in the morning. Like I said, boys, it's a beautiful morning in the woods. Come up on our first snare in a few minutes. Like I said, I always like the anticipation of looking at your snares when you walk up on them. Check see if there's anything in them. nothing in that one and since I'm going home today guys I'm going to strike up all my snares and I'll lay them out again next time I come back so I just pull them tight and uh, <clears throat> set them out again next time so another one on that side and oh more snare Another snare here. Looked like a good run. Nothing in that one either. So we strike that one up too. That's two snares. Let's see how it goes. One night on snares is not hardly enough. But this time of year, when it gets warm during the day, you don't want a rabbit be sitting in there. Oh, looks like I had to strike. Something went through here on the snare. Maybe a squirrel. They get hit one side. Oh well. Put that up there for next week, next time. And I got one back here. This one's a bit in out of the way. And unfortunately, nothing in this one either. We'll come back next week. Set them out again. So that's four snares. One more to go. Only one more to go. Maybe our luck will get. Maybe we'll get lucky. <gasps> well, 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 well. Look at that guys, one out of five. Again. One bunny. It's a young rabbit. There, now that's going to sit back out. Well, guys, it's a pretty good rabbit. Like that. 
one out of five. Gonna make great, great for the pot. Get back home now, clean this up. It's a good day. Take that in the fridge, in the house now, clean it up, and uh, I'll have a pot of soup or something. Rabbit stew, whatever. So guys, this concludes my uh, little uh, adventure sending a few snares. Successful on the first adventure. Hopefully more to come throughout the winter. Talk to you later. Whatever. Anyway, that's uh, my first set of rat set up. Uh, that's my first uh, attempt at rabbit catching, snaring this summer. This summer. Take two. Mm -hmm.